so welcome back darks welcome back dark saber um is your ship the red and black one the endeavor kill you huh the endeavor kill you and i'm glitched inside of my ship oh go don't worry about that let's just continue with your review i'm sure you know what it looks like so how about you tell me all about it well uh, it was originally meant to be a orbital bombardment ship yeah. Uh, it's filled with a crap ton of D1000s. Yeah. That do massive amounts of damage. Got ya. Uh, but this is just a random kill your version for absolutely no reason because I was bored. Oh, okay. So, yeah. so, did you build this all yourself? Yes. Excellent. And obviously, you can see you've used a mix of hardened and normal hulls for detail. You've got a, quite a bit of wedging with some nice scaffolding on your front camera there. That's a very nice touch. I'm just going to dip underneath. Yeah, Take a quick I look through your front windscreen, and I can see you've got a nice bridge in there as well. So we're going to have to take a little yeah. look-see in there in a second. Uh, there's also that shuttle that you were showing us earlier. So I That's think what I'll do... Don't worry about it, mate. We'll just do it. You know, we've got you here, so that's the main thing. This turret, are these turrets on the back? Uh, no, those are fighters. They're fighters? Cool, cool. I was wondering, because you never know. Um, yeah, I'm gonna add turrets, uh, preferably where the Gemini go currently, which are the spiky things on the front. Okay. So, are these... They're not turrets, are they? No, nothing that's docked to the ship currently is a turret. Okay, excellent. I was just wondering, because I saw them, and I was like, oh, wow, with these actually turrets, <laughs> they would be pretty impressive. I could very well make a turret version. All I have to do is slice off the bottom of it, and then add the missiles somewhere else. Oh, no, it's fine how it is, mate. I wouldn't tell you to do anything differently. Uh, it's all a learning curve at the end of the day, so I'm sure that your next ship will be better than this one, and so on and so on. So, but this one's excellent. I really do like what you've done with it. The uh, pattern for the back engines there is outstanding. Like I say, uh, a lot of people just slap the lava down and they're done. So that's very nice. Uh, you've got nice negative space between all of your other engine pods, these sort of satellite engine pods. You haven't just gone with straight lines, which is kind of nice. It breaks up the uh, flow of the hull. Um, four fighters, so I guess you could class this as a carrier, like you say. Um, yeah, that's what I was going for. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, I finally got out. I can tell you, like, mass and thrust and stuff. Yeah, if you want, but like I say, it's not that essential these days. Because everything's really subject to change, you see. So really, it's just yeah. about what does it look like? Does it have weapons? Is it cool? <laughs> I'd say it's pretty cool. So I'm going to follow you in through this door here. And we're going to miss most of the stuff out. We're just going to literally go, ha ha, core! Found the core. Weapons computer, two D1000 computers. I'm going to peek my head through some of these. Three D1000 computers. Three. <clears throat> oh, I can only see two of them. So there we have some decorative panels on the bridge. And then we got some chairs. Got an interesting... Is this a bed? Uh, the rooms to the right and left of the bridge are crew quarters. Oh, uh, right, okay, so that must be And a then table. the little room behind the captain's chair is a captain's quarters. Oh, so that is a captain's chair. Nice, okay. It's an interesting chair. It's a different chair. I can actually get in through my doors, which are being stupid because of yeah, lag. Yeah, the doors do that during lag, but hey, don't worry. It's alpha, early alpha, isn't it? So, yeah, these things yep. happen. Could be worse, could be null point ring. Uh -huh. Yes, it very well could be. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, that's the way I see it. So. There's my table. The... Oh, yeah, it's my desk. Let's see, on both left and right sides, yep. by the doors to get into the ship itself, there's uh, one side is a little Zen garden, and the other side is a med bay. Oh, okay, yep, yeah, nice. Nice garden, dude. That's really cool. Uh, and then in the back of it, there's a random hangar that is kind of useless because whenever I undock from it, it glitches inside of the ship. It's just kind of there now. Oh, Med Bay is really fresh, actually. Bad, you're gonna do. That's quite cool in there. You've got good ideas in there. And you said there's a random hangar at the back. Oh yeah, it's between like the two pod things that are on the back. It's on both sides. Oh wow, what this thing? Is she... Well, yeah, there is. Yeah, isn't... it's just kind of there. It's just kind of there, yeah. <laughs> How'd you get in here? You go at it from the sides between the pods there's some oh yeah there's some doors. doors yeah i got them very nice well there it is so how long do you think it took you to finish this beauty uh without 
just the hole itself took half an hour to an hour. I wasn't really counting the time. Yep, yep. And then uh, the interior and internals itself probably took another two hours. Very nice. Yep, this is one of my smaller ships, not counting, like, one of the smaller, bigger ships, I guess. Well, I can't wait to see the next one. Thank you very much for bringing it along, and I hope to see you in a future review. Alrighty then. Yeah, so what was the name of this ship one more time? Uh, this is the Endeavour Carrier. The, the normal Endeavour one the Endeavour. Carrier. Yeah, the normal one's just the Endeavour. Nice. Okay, well, uh, thanks very much, Dark Saber. I can't wait to see you again. And thanks to everybody watching. So we'll see you all next time. Goodbye.